in Hyderabad or India, the major problem is will we have water for the next 20 years, next 10 years, next 5 years? That's a real concern when we talk to any person who is like trying to save the environment, right? So with that, like the one thing earlier, like we had products where we measure water quantity, water quality. And one more thing is how do we measure the ground level, ground water level? So this is one of the things we have developed where it's a simple logic. The wall goes down and tries to tell till what water level is there. So that it helps us because it's connected again, we is connected to one to m dashboard. We know what is the water level and how long the water would be available. And similarly, one more problem is like uh, you have this water level sensors where we define the tanks. A lot of the tanks or reservoirs, the major problem what we found is water loss due to evaporation is sometimes way huge. One of the people like uh, I met uh, one of the professors from NID and he suggested that a lot of places reservoirs if you measure the water level, it would have been better to divert that water to the villages rather than storing there. Because of the summer heat, a lot of water is getting evaporated. And a lot of places because the lid is open or something, we notice one of the places in Triple ID also. Suddenly there was like, what is going where? There is no concern there. And we realized like it is going through evaporation. And other purpose is water level, based on the water level, when to pump the water, when not to pump the water. Because when the tank is full, you need not pump the water. So all the control is possible because everything is connected. Now, like with this, like we were talking to water board and relevant officials, we understood that we should try to capture how much is the rainwater and how much is the groundwater and can we recycle treatment and try to give the fresh water. So, like we should ensure, like when we are telling the people also, we can treat the water and give you. So, there should be sensors saying that this is fresh water drinkable so that people will be feel safe. This is like one kind of dashboard which tries to exam, experiment and show you how much rainwater uh, harvesting water is collected, how much through the ground we are able to collect and through treatment how many households we can supply. So this is like not using the manjira or uh, bore water, it is like whatever collected through rain we are trying to redirect for usage. So, all these methods become really useful for the long run. Instead of saying 5 years, we should go to 10, 15, 20 or 100 years to save the water. So, these are like, we have different sensors deployed and we have experimented in IIIT in Hyderabad. Once we take it to the city, similar solutions, I think a lot of development, a lot of water saving can be done. And to my knowledge, what I heard is, till now, they don't bring water tankers to IIIT in Hyderabad. So we were self-sustained with rainwater harvesting and understanding the consumption pattern. So at WIT, uh, the Smart City Living Lab, we are doing very interesting topics and very interesting research which can basically uh, go as a, which will have very good impact on the society. So one very good example of that is the deployment of uh, water level sensors in the temples of Prashtapati Museum. And this project is in collaboration with the rainwater project. And we have de uh, deployed in the, the renovated steppels, we have deployed the uh, different sensors for measuring the water level in the steppels. And in addition to that, we also deployed some sensors to understand uh, how often the motors are, uh, let's say, used. And then we are also going to deploy some underwater, uh, let's say, what is the bore well uh, water level monitoring we will also be doing. In addition to that, we also have this uh, water level water supply pool. And, uh, we already signed the MOU, but uh, like and the further discussions are in process right now. We are very uh, we are very interested to apply all of our new technology what we have developed in IIIT and deployed in the IIIT campus. Uh, we want to now uh, deploy in the different locations in the Hyderabad city.